Hi everyone, I'm completely sick and uh, it's been like not a week but uh, since uh, Monday everyone was sick in my house so I ended up being sick and uh, I have a runny nose, it's horrible, I just cannot stand this stuff anymore. I have to carry uh, a, a ton of paper with me tissues and uh, run out of tissue, I don't feel like going to supermarket, I'm very very tired. And, um, well, you know what? I'm checking on YouTube what I can do. So I tried the pot with the steam water. It doesn't work. Um, maybe like five minutes later, it's coming back. So it's pretty bad. And uh, so I'm going to... Hmm. Well, I'm going to share the screen with you if I can. So talk to you in two seconds. So this is what I found on Google. Uh, I don't feel like watching the video. I'm really lazy today. I just don't want... I want a, a quick and instant uh, solution. So say how to get rid of a runny nose fast, what uh, will dry up a runny nose, and how long does a runny nose take to go away, what does my nose run like water, it's what's going on. Huh? Okay, so let's go to this. And let's see. So meanwhile, I'm going to blow my nose like crazy. Na, 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 na. Viral infection of the sinuses, common cold, <sniffs> allergies, that's not my case, it's cold right now, high fever, high fever, other causes. Okay. Stop a runny nose, drink plenty of fluids, that's what I'm doing. So I'm taking my cat away because she's going through my Christmas tree. Uh, I drink. Soup, um, tea, and everything doesn't work. Hot tea is what I did. Fish on steam, I did. Hot showers, did it. Neti pot, no. I don't really like too much this stuff. Eating spicy food is what I did uh, yesterday. I ate a lot of spicy food, and I mean Mexican style. Uh, yeah. I did it, I did it, and okay, so nope. Stop running nose. Best home remedy to get rid of. Okay. Uh, mm, 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 mm. Yeah. So, do I have to go through YouTube? So, let's see. Of course I'm gonna have an ad. Of course I'm gonna have an ad. Oh my goodness, I just don't like this stuff. It is like Ty Lopez, or there is another one. Is like uh, I don't remember the name. There's a woman. I lost my 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 boyfriend. He cheated on me. And now it's like Mind Valley, and they have all the solutions for you. And meanwhile, I don't becoming rich. So screw you. Sorry, I'm not gonna turn on the the the, the sound. I want something to work now because it's annoying. Okay, how to stop la 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 la. Okay, come on. I'm not gonna subscribe until by the end of this year you will. Okay. Oh, there is acupressure as well. Come on. Have a hot drink. That's what I keep doing. It doesn't work. Yeah, yes, I'm gonna explain why the hot drink is good for you. The steam, neti pot. Well, yeah. sorry. A new lady. Is it the same? Yeah, it's the same. So, it doesn't work so far. Okay. Weird videos here. Bo. Yeah, to explain why, I don't care. I don't really care, seriously. Nitty pot. I clean my nose regularly, there's no problem. So, is it like gently massage your nose between your eyes and your love to see this pressure? Okay. Well, you know what? Runny nose, uh, 
acupressure. That's just one C, sorry about that. Uh, allergy, it's not an allergy, it's really a cold. Acupressure treatments, acupressure for cold virus relief. Okay. I just want to show you guys what works. And again, we have Mind Valley, you know, here to help your mind and get richer. Okay, lady, you're gonna explain to us what is a cold and everything. So, let's see here. I'm more willing to try this kind of stuff. And. So we'll go ahead and start with a point that's at the top of the head. So if you have a cold just starting to come on, um, this is a nice one. You just use like your middle finger, and we're just going to tap 12 times gently at the top of the head. So I'm doing it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay. I'll do it even more. Just like that. And that's the first one. The second point is going to be at the top of the spine. So you're going to take two fingers and it's just where the hair. spine uh, touches the skull. You're okay. going to go both sides of the spine. Okay. Now well, use your hair, it's you not easy. You gentle lady. pressure. Okay, so what am I doing? So the key just for these pressure, pressure points is that you want to find the tender spot. So as you're pressing them, you're looking for that spot where you feel that little bit of tenderness, and then that's the spot. You want to just go ahead and hold it for about 15 seconds and give it like One, a little stimulating two, rub, three, and then go ahead and four, release. Five, the six, third spot is right seven, at the base eight. of the nose, right where the nose... I'm not done. Uh, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, uh, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, 15. Okay, I don't even know how to count anymore. My brain is so messed up. Okay, there's another one. She's showing on the face now. Just the cheeks. So you're, again, you're going to just find that tender spot okay. and just a gentle stimulation or pressure. And you can even kind of just gently move the fingers a little bit. And go ahead and stay for about 15 seconds. You might feel a little flush in the body, which is the signal to you that you found the right spot and your body is gently releasing some of the tension there. And then the fourth spot is found on the leg. This is one of the five main pain centers of the body. So if you go, we're going to do this on both sides. If you go ahead and go to the leg to your knee and okay. one hand's length down from the knee. So you're going one length down and then from the bone you're going to go out to the side in a little divot. And again, you're just going to kind of poke and prod until you find that tender spot. This one is probably the most challenging spot to find. No, no, I can't feel it. Once you find it, it is very it's very weird. You and can, you can find it. We're just going to go ahead and gently stimulate easy. that point with a little bit of pressure. And after you do it for about 15 seconds, we'll gently release. And you're going to do the same spot on the other side. Okay, well, ooh, I'm not going to... Sorry about that. So, okay, let me go back to my real face and let's see if it's working, okay? So, after checking the videos on uh, YouTube, there is a lot of similar stuff like the neti pot, uh, uh, steaming your nose and everything. Um, well, I did the acupressure. I think it's the best bet. Uh, I don't like the neti pot, I don't like the salty stuff, it doesn't work, it's always coming back right away, the hot shower, it's okay, but uh, it doesn't really last long, and uh, my voice is a bit better, <clears throat> I just did uh, like one, where is it, two, uh, three, and four, five points, two on each, I mean one on each leg, and um, I'm not blowing my nose, my eyes are not even watery, and uh, I'm feeling a bit better. It's not, I'm not, I'm not like uh, healed. Oh my God, oh, it's a miracle. No, no, no. It's just, uh, I have that. Um, it's, uh, it's better. I can breathe a bit, but you know, I still have to blow a bit my nose, but it's not running. 
Okay, it's disgusting because sometimes you always have to have paper with you and <clears throat> sometimes you don't, okay? And you're like, oh my God, and it's just like running everywhere. It's okay, it's fine, it's working. The best thing was acupressure for me. So uh, I'll do it several times a day and let's see if I'm not longer sick or less sick tomorrow because... Well, I have to, to work, I have to pick up my daughter, I have to do a lot of stuff, so I cannot be sick like that. I cannot afford to be sick. So anyway, so here we go, capricious points. That's the best bet for me anyway. Take care.